Hello, 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 hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking on to my video. This video will be for whoever needs to hear this at this time. So all signs, you are welcomed. Okay, keep in mind this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the parts that does, what doesn't, leave it on out, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alrighty, y'all. I don't know exactly what you guys got going on um, within your life, but I'm going to just say this, baby. If your energy low... Okay, you've been feeling fatigue. Some of you be having a little bit of headaches. Um, some of you definitely have a prosperous, abundant life, but it's just like you're not feeling motivated. And, you know, you could be feeling a little bit down. Um, yeah. If so, keep watching. Okay. Um, there's a couple of people here that you need to get rid of. All right. Like these people are energy vampires. Okay. Um, whether they not be around you physically or what have you, they're not able to let you go. So you're going to have to do some type of a cord cutting here. I don't know who this person is or why they keep doing this, but you're going to have to do some type of a cord cutting. Okay. Like you're going to have to do it, whether you want to double in that magic or not. Okay. This, this is what's needed is what spirit's saying. This is what's needed. Okay. Do some type of, if you need some information or what have you, I do know a, you know, a few things to be honest with you, boo. I don't, I don't cast no spells. I'd like to, you know, do my protection or what have you, my spiritual bath, what have you. But as far as in somebody, some of y'all going to have to up it up a little bit. This is what I'm hearing. Okay. Y'all might have to do something, you know, a little bit more. I, you know what I mean? I'm going to tell you that now. Okay. Because it is about, I don't know what type of status you have in life, baby, but you know, your work is speaking for yourself, your your personality, your aura, your beauty, your shine, your spirit, everything is shining right now, baby. And there's a few people from your past that cannot believe it. Okay, some people, they're not even mad about the fact that, or what, what, what it is that you have the gift. It's basically about, yeah, they hate you on that too, but it's just about why did it have to be you? Why did it have to be you to be put in this position? Why not me? You get what I'm saying? So that is what these people are, you know, but one of them is a lover. Another person could have been a friend, a family member, what have you. All right. But it's like, they're mad at the fact that God chose you. Okay. They wanted to have what you have. They wanted to be what you are. So it's like these people are trying to go beyond, I'm telling you beyond to try to stop you, baby. Okay, we even have your actual death. So y'all gonna have to y'all yeah, y'all gonna have to do what y'all do. Okay, y'all gonna have to do what y'all do. All right. And it's not like anything on the backfire because spirit is saying you need to do that. You need to do that because somebody's dedicated to trying to harm you or what have you. All right. Yes, you are protected. Yes, you are. Okay. And that's why it ain't doing nothing to you. You're still successfully still prosperous. But if you want to feel completely free. Off the shackles, like you want to get up every day, great rising, you know what I'm saying? Be free like the wind, oh, you know? Then it's like, you're going to have to do some type of cord cutting because they ain't trying to let you go. But then again, for some of y'all, somebody's going to go through an actual death for trying to stop you. Okay, then whoever these people are, y'all, they have been warned. They have been fucking warned. And it's like they keep, oh, Lord, I ain't going to get into it, okay? But you you get my drift, right? I know you get my drift, okay, whoever these people are. But it's like at the end of the day, though, collective, like these people can't do nothing. Nobody's listening to them. They already know. Yeah, these spreading rumors, yeah, spreading rumors, no one's listening to them. So everybody knows that this person is lying. They know. So don't even worry about it. OK, it ain't about what they doing behind your back, but it's about when it comes to that magic shit, whatever fuck they trying to do to that negative energy, baby. It's like you're going to have to up up your protection. You are protected. Yes. But um, you still. Oh, you hear that thunder? Come on now. Mm, come on now. Let's let's get into it. Let's get into it. Let's get into it, boo. OK. Yes. Everything is magical around us and we all have signs and shit like that. So it's like you're going to have to do some type of cord cutting, baby. If you don't know how to do that, do what these bitches do. Google that shit, okay? Do what you got to do, all right? Because of the way they work hard against you, baby, you need to work hard against their asses too. Because this is something to take heed to now because, yes, you have everything that you want. Everything that you want to be granted to you. Everything. And it's still coming. Your manifestations are still coming. Listen to that thunder, baby. Oh, I love. Okay? But... 
and still coming but at the same time you know these people are dedicated to like uh, this is how you know you the shit this is how you know you are the shit boo okay everybody going against you little old you little old you everybody going against you when you have to have an army go against one you got to be a powerful mother an army go against one Ooh, i need to write that down well, hold on a second Yes, Humpty, because, you know, you are the assignment, baby. Okay, army against one here, honey. Wow, they had to. Y'all, hold on. I'm doing too much. But anyway, and so, yeah, so they had to definitely do or, you know, come against you. All these people that come against, oh, little old you, okay? Like, you are powerful all by your fucking self, honey. And I'm getting, I'm hearing leeches. These people are leeches. They are vampire, energy vampires, okay? They, like, blood-sucking ticks. They need your energy. They need you. So they're trying to take it spiritually, okay? But all it can do is just make you tired a little bit for some of y'all. I keep going baby it's so easy to fight through that fucking magic because once you got something set in your mind can't nothing stop you but anyway we also have once again your angels okay your angels don't play that about you your ancestors don't play that about you somebody watch you here okay and that's pure point blank they've been seeing what's going on okay what they want you to do is smile okay look up to the most high and smile all right some of you need to call on your ancestors if you don't know who they are then definitely you need to uh try to figure that out through someone with heavy okay um as far as the tarot reader or you know call out and be like ancestors reveal yourself to me now everybody communicate with theirs in whatever way i'll call but yes all right y'all so here's another thing okay this person was saying like they hate our love they hate our love okay so i don't know if this was like an old lover here that you were dealing with okay and this person now they know that these people were jealous and they hate the love that you guys had and once shared so it's like but it's like it says it was a secret and this was a secret too what they were doing and this person knew what they were doing so whatever this this masculine was doing it's unforgivable to be honest with you i mean you might not be feeling on top of way but you know it's unforgivable Especially you doing some type of magic. You go you doing magic, bro, sis. You dark magic. Nah, that's unforgivable. <laughs> that's unforgivable. We ain't got time for that right there. Okay, no, 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 no. Some of you also could be just taking care of your health, eating right, exercising, trying to get in that gym or you working out at home, pushing it, stroking it. Uh you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying, Lord. Get your mind out the gutter. Okay, anyway. Ooh, here go the ancestors. First, we had your angels here. Okay, your entities, your, your spirit guides, what have you. Same damn thing. They all the same damn thing. But anyway, uh -huh, your ancestors is on them hard, honey. He surely is. He's on these people hard. So, there's nothing for you to worry about, boo, at all. Okay. I'm also getting that there could have been a friend, an old friend, or what have you that's been trying to get in contact with you. This could also be a family member, all right? Um, she been trying to call you. She been trying to text you or whatnot. But in actuality, she's a hater, okay? Whoever this female is, she's a hater. She actually wants to be you, but she can never be you, okay? I don't give a damn. Y'all got the same blood. The same blood run through y'all veins. She could never be you, okay? Because you operate in the light and she operates in the dark, okay? She just trying to compete with you, but she can't compete with you because she want to be like you. <laughs> so you got a fan, all right? So a fan wants to highlight you for a minute, you know, a moment or what have you. Uh-huh. She knows that you are better than her. And it's not that I, nobody's better than nobody, okay? But this is how she feels, okay? Um, yeah. So she's saying that you're better than her, okay? I'm getting that sometimes some of you could have been peeping game about this person. This person could have been revealing themselves to you, okay? Some of them even could have been a fucking shapeshifter. You know what I'm saying? Demons be shapeshifting now. Shit. And um, you could have seen her... Oh, let me tell you how you really point out a motherfucker. When you just chilling and you sitting down and that person so happened to be in front of your face, right? And you turn, you look at them and they looking at you and like a crazy look. But then they turn around and they, they be like, they start smiling and shit. Oh, run, bitch. That's a hater. Run, bitch. She's only around you for clout. She don't fuck with you like that. Okay? She only around you for clout. Okay? She want to see what, uh, you know, she want attention. By your clout, by you, okay? Yeah. I know one time 
this chick, she basically grew up with me, ex-friend or whatever. She grew up with me, y'all, right? And this hoe had the nerve. Like, she's she been there through everything, okay? Everything. All right? And this other female that I was going through something with, okay? I, t I vented to her about the situation or what have you. Let me tell you now, you can't tell these hoes everything because everybody ain't your friend. But we all, we live and we learn. Honey, take an example, baby. Been through it, been there, done that. So, but yeah, so, um... She tried to invite me to this event knowing that this other chick, dog, I mean, this chick did some ruthless ass shit to me. Like, you would be shocked. You would think I'm lying. Okay, you would think I'm lying about what the fuck this bitch was doing to me. Okay, tried to be, you know, behind my back, but really in my motherfucking face. You, 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 yeah, it's crazy. But anyway, so she tried to invite me to an event, was like, hey, can you come to so and so with so and so? Um, so we could just chill out and, you know, drink some, whatever. first of all, I don't even drink like that. Okay. Second of all, it's like, y'all get too fucking drunk and I ain't with that shit. But anyway, third of all, you know what the fuck was going on with this chick. So why would you invite me there knowing damn well this bitch dog me out? So that means that you are also a hater. You're trying to set me the fuck up. Okay. And I don't play that shit. Nobody gonna set me up, bitch. So, you know, I was like, fuck you in the hoe. Y'all can go do what y'all do, bitch, because I, I don't hang out with fake-ass bitches. That's one thing I don't do. And that's one thing I, I, you know, with females, bitches don't be, you know, liking me. I be creating enemies with these hoes because it's like I have no problem with cutting them off. I know when to cut their asses off. Like, I always done that as a child. I don't know what the fuck. But it's crazy. But um, this other chick, though, the one that really did, that really did me dirty, that chick right there, mm -mm, she ruthless. And I ain't never would have thought that one. Mm, so y'all gotta check y'all circle. I'm getting so y'all gotta check y'all circle. Definitely get these squares about your circle because these people here are haters. So I'm getting this is that type of friend that's trying to reach out to you. So she invites you anywhere or what have you. Pay attention to your intuition because if you have to even question a bitch in the first place, that ain't your friend. That ain't your friend. And these bitches probably talking about you behind your back when you're not around. Not everybody got time for that. Get rid of these foes, period. All right, but these these is the type of friend that's trying to come back, and this ex lover here. But let me tell you something else, honey. Some of y'all could be dealing with a new partner, or there will be a new partner that's gonna come in for some particular reason. I don't know why. This could have been an admirer, admirer for some of y'all, be or this person you're with this person now, and he, they admire, they adore you. So this will be the, this is this new person, but that's the thing. There has, there's going to be people watching this situation, whether that be this friend or this ex-lover. I don't know why these people are so obsessed with you to the point where they want to just, you know, be all up in your energy, baby. Your energy. What is going on with these folk? Okay, but they obsessed with you. It's like this bitch want to fuck you the way she all up on your ass. All right? And this dude, he just a regret because whatever he tried to do, you know what I'm saying, or he, you know, dismiss you, got one other chick. Seeing that the grass was a greener on the other side, and now he want to come back. Okay, now he realized y'all love that everybody hated on y'all love, but you don't give a damn because you moving on to better, bigger, and better. Okay, but y'all, y'all, but I'm getting your new part is like, wow, they're looking at you, they probably looking at you going through what you go through. Let me tell you something about some men, okay, not all men, so don't get offended. Some men, before they approach you. They have already been watching your ass for about two to three months before they approach you. <laughs> okay, I'm going to tell you that right now. Because some of y'all men are right there. I could be with that man right now. Okay, y'all could be with that man right now. God dang it. But <laughs> somebody been watching you for a while. Okay, and there might be an admirer that's going to come through. All right, but anyway, this person is proud of you. This person is going to um, show you um, how beautiful you're doing in life. They're going to inspire. They're going to uplift you. Okay, this is like a healing energy here. So somebody's going to match your energy here. Okay, but anyway, yeah. I'm also getting that these people, these enemies, whoever the people were, they wanted to know your secret. But it's not even like it's a secret because it's in your fucking DNA. You can't even explain it. You feel what I'm saying? It's in your DNA. I got loyalty. I, what to say? I got royalty. I ro inside my DNA. I got royalty, royalty inside my DNA. Period. It's like it's something that you cannot explain. It's just in you. Okay? Yeah. Boop. 
Ain't that funny? Words can't do no justice. Honey bad. Honey bad. Honey bad. But anyway, let's go ahead. Let me see here. This is what came out. It says, ooh, nothing will come of a situation, y'all. It's saying nothing will come of the situation. So don't even worry about it. This um, this ex-lover, this friend, they can't touch you. They can't touch you. Nothing will come of the situation. Okay? Like I said, nobody, are, nobody ain't even, even listen to them. Okay? So it don't even matter. Spirit is saying, still have faith in your dreams. Okay, definitely. Then we have here, bring love into a situation. Wow. So I'm seeing that you handle situations more with love. All right, you ain't got time for that arguing because you're already balanced. You already know uh, who these people are. All right, but um, yeah, this could have been, or there's an Aquarius that wants to bring love into a situation here. Uh huh. Then we have here, conclusions are within reach. Okay, so. I'm definitely getting that everything is going to work out here. All right, you're going to get all the answers to what it is that you need. And then we have here a new start is coming. So come on now. So everything is about to close out on this shit. Whatever this is here. Okay. Because, baby, but still, I'm going to still advise you, okay, to do that damn core cutting. Because these people are doing some shit every day. I'm, I believe they're doing it every single day. Okay. I, I definitely believe that they're doing this shit every day. So it's just like you have to protect yourself, okay? But you are protected. Your ancestors on their ass hard. But that's why it's like it ain't hitting you. It's just you getting a little bit un I won't say unmotivated, but it just it mess up your moods. But spirit wants you to boom recognize that shit. Okay? Cause while they watching you, your ancestors are watching them. All right, but at the, in the 3D realm, in the 3D realm, because they fucking them up in the spiritual realm, but in the 3D realm, baby, you're going to have to put core cutting, do some core cutting, do some core cutting, okay, bitch? But yeah, all right, all right, boo, all right, let's see what else. Ooh, come on now, this situation will improve, period, period. This situation will improve, then we had nothing will come of the situation, and your situation will improve, okay, so... This shit ain't gonna do nothing to you. Okay, peaceful res can't make it up, baby. Peaceful resolution and also in love here. Okay, in romance. Wow. Ooh, it says within the next few weeks. Come on now, spirit. Within the next few weeks. Okay, romance is coming in. All right. Don't even worry about these people trying to, you know, suck your damn energy. Okay. Ooh, leeches and shit. Leeches, leeches. Ooh. Okay, let's see. What else? Let me get one of these. I ain't even get into the tarot. Oh goodness. Somebody needed to hear this. But um, oh yes, baby. So that's the ace of cups. I mean eight of cups here. So the need to move on, seeking more from life than what you're experiencing. See? It's a spiritual quest, choosing to make big life changes, a change in priorities, and leaving home. See, some of y'all been feeling a little bit unmotivated here because somebody was playing in your energy, but um, just, just like I said, do what it is you need to do. You know what I'm talking about? But then we have here the, um, the ace, what is this? The ace of coins here, a windfall of abundance. Wow. So there is a windfall of abundance coming in. I know I can't see, but anyway, um, there's some good fortune. So don't worry about none of this shit, but you want to be feeling blessed in a moment, you know, in the 3d realm, like as far as like, you know, not feeling fatigued. This this shell, this body is not feeling down and drained. It's like you need to you need to work on that root chakra. You need to do your affirmations or what have you, y'all. Come on now, cause ain't nobody gonna try to like stop you know not make you feel happy for your blessings. You gotta let these folks go. You gotta protect yourself, okay? But anyway, um, I'm definitely seeing some type of contract is coming up too for you guys very soon. All right, it's gonna be a new purchase to a home or a vehicle for some of y'all. All right, I'm definitely seeing, wow, that's going to be a, a, ooh, an amazing opportunity coming in. But but when it comes in, Spirit is saying, be bold, be courageous, and optimistic. Woo, now is the time to take action. Do what you're passionate about, period, okay? That's period, y'all. All right, who can I be talking to, Spirit, Holy Spirit, ancestors? Who am I, who am I speaking to? Who am I speaking to? Virgo. Sun, okay? Sun and Virgo. For some of y'all, the sun can symbolize a Leo, okay? Let's see what else. Yeah, boom, there we go, Leo. <laughs> Scorpio. Let's see. Capricorn. Okay, uh, moon and Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn moon placement. Let's see. What else? Anybody else? Anybody else? Okay, Sagittarius, 
Who else? Okay. Fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Once again. Okay. Fire sign. Okay. Earth sign. Towards Virgo, Capricorn. All right. All righty, guys. Y'all can have those anywhere, too. Like in your moon placement or your sun. Okay. Your rising. All right, you guys. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys. If you need anything from me, you want to purchase a personal reading, you want to ask me one or two questions, um, you would like to donate to my channel or add me on Instagram, I am, I think I'm at 300 or a little bit over. Like I said, I pick and choose who I add, okay? But I thank you guys so freaking much, and I will see you guys in the next reading. God bless. Stay up, y'all. Take yourselves. You got this. Bye.